with. Us boys all woke up early and we began to cook the girls breakfast. Breakfast in bed. Cook yeah, the girls yeah, breakfast, yeah. not cook the girls. <laughs> Hello, how are you this morning? Hi. So what were you what are you doing? I'm cleaning off the table here. Why are you cleaning off the table here? Do you have a feeling like something's going to happen? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Why are the guys walking into our room with a tray? Well, we made you breakfast. You did? What a surprise. <laughs> all you guys in the shot. Right, Too closer. You guys are uh, very valuable assets to this team, and <laughs> we don't think that we have expressed that enough this week. And we just wanted to express our appreciation for you two by making you breakfast. Breakfast. Yay. We made a French vanilla latte <laughs> and a green tea latte, and Dan made... Um, Per toast. Perfect touch yogurt as well. <laughs> some bananas. I cut blue. Just did everything. Luke, I did the blue. The look. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> the, the, blue the, blue the beautiful look is Luke's. If you notice, <laughs> there is a you, spoon fork kind of triangle at the top of the plate. That was Luke's. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Luke. Luke also <laughs> cut the blueberries <laughs> very beautifully. Beautifully. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> and I also arranged. Well, oh, and Eric, and Eric and did did both of you guys do the syrups? We yeah we proportioned so the syrups. They yes, proportioned the syrups. <laughs> Yes. Sorry, we didn't have enough orange juice. That's all right. Yeah, like not even for enough for one cup. Yes. So, Anything yeah. else? We'll let you eat it while the French toast is still hot. Oh well, thank you. <laughs> you guys rock. Thank you guys for all you've been doing. Yeah. Thank you for you. being awesome and making us breakfast. <laughs> Yay. We'll be downstairs. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to make our breakfast now. <laughs> okay, well, thank you, guys. <laughs> what is missing on this plate? We have a spoon, a fork, French toast. What don't we have? Anything to say? A knife. We don't have a knife. So all the guys were very thoughtful. I made us, you know, lattes and apple juice and syrup in a cup. <laughs> syrup shots. That's what it's like. <laughs> they didn't get us a knife. So we are going to hate them forever. And this trip is going to be horrible now. All because we didn't get a knife. So, yay, happy ending to a movie. <laughs> all right. <laughs> After that, we all got ready for the coffee shot, which was when Dan and Paul... Eric tried to also be failed. Um, Dan and Paul... I did not fail, I succeeded. ...put coffee for a bunch of people that came over. And you don't cook, you coffee. brew coffee. Uh, <laughs> they, we, we, they made... <laughs> and we all... Luke is just failing um, right now. The rest of us communicate with people. I thought Luke we totally, all did a good job because Luke we talked with non Christians. Totally, like, burns his leg. No, no, no. Oh, Paul. Paul. <laughs> Can we just start this vlog over? <laughs> no, so far it's a total success. It's okay. A total success. Oh, so we've had a lot Paul, of candid moments. Paul, like, mega burns his leg. Yeah. And I will insert a clip of him burning his leg. Well, not him, but him <laughs> reacting the burn. <laughs> We're going to burn Paul's life I think it's a good cannonball that shows the true nature of the group. We're um, stupid. So we had no, two. We'll we are stupid. Paul killed Eric. his leg. Care to explain what happened? Um, well, I was making a latte, and, well, me and the machine didn't really agree, so we kind of got into it a little bit. And, well, I won, but I didn't uh, get out completely free. Ah, crazy. It's looking, it's looking a little better. <laughs> but uh, that steam wand really got me. Uh, I know what it looks like. It's a scrape or something, you know? But that's actually a burn. Yes, it is a burn. And I did bleed. Um, yeah, it was not fun. Awesome. It feels pretty good now. I can't really feel anything, actually. It's all numb. At the coffee shop, Dan and Paul brewed coffee. And Eric attempted to. I, I attempted and, and succeeded. Failed. And succeeded. And the rest of us all um, communicated with people at the I met, tables. Yeah, I met a Japanese twin. I have a twin in Japan. Her name is Ira, and she's awesome because we're both left-handed, and we're both born in September, and we both like crazy clothes. And what else? I don't remember. She was pretty cool. Yeah, I gave her a soda tab bracelet, and we email, and she is so stellar. It, it camera. Yes, so it's taking she a movie. Taking a movie. A movie? Yeah. <laughs> What? Let's talk talking. Yeah, you can talk. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Anything?
thing to say. Hey, good night. Yay for Japanese twins. And, and Eric met a man named Tom, and he hadn't talked to anyone else at any of our social events. So. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he's a Japanese man. His name is Mr. Nakamura, and uh, he is a Christian who became a Christian many years ago when he stayed for two years in the United States. So when he came back to Japan, he uh, struggled with being a Christian for a long time, and then he started to going to church again in the last five or six years. He's really awesome. Yeah. yeah. Well, then we had a second coffee shop after that, and we met a person named Yuki. Her name means snow. And we met her daughter, Lisa, who is awesome. They, mm, Yuki, cool. is the wife of the guy who came to our evening Bible study the night before and who gave the awesome testimony that we'll see day four video, yay, for information about that. Mr. <laughs> and then, yes, and then um, Lisa is awesome. She will be going to our North Star camp in the yes. next couple of days, because <laughs> it's day five. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, that was really awesome, talking with them. We talked a bunch, and um, anything else? And after the coffee shop, what did, we, what did we do? After the coffee shop, we had orientation uh, with yeah. John about oh, stuff okay. in Japan. We learned a bunch, and learned a lot, yeah. And then, after that, what happens? Oh, Mrs. Uh, Yoshino, um, a lady from the church, um, who also has a Christian bookstore in town, came over and she had made us dinner, and she talked to us about uh, her Bible study that she does every Tuesday. And so she, uh, we knew that we were invited to come the next day, and so she talked to us about kind of her heart for the women that come. And um, they are mostly non-Christian women. And so she does a Bible study in English. And so she invited us to come. And to we did a little bit of uh, talking about what we're going to do. And so we decided on doing some drama. And also uh, that Monica would share her testimony. So it's just a really, really uh, kind and wise lady who speaks great English. Mm -hmm. So... Yeah, and that was fun. Yeah, she's really, uh, I think, kind of inspiring for all of us. Practice for our skit and the drawing and stuff. So we will perform for you what we will be performing tomorrow. Just little snippets. God said, let there be plants and trees. And it happened. God said, these plants and trees will have fruit with seeds. And from these seeds, other plants and trees will grow. God liked what he had created. And that's how the third day ended. God said, Let there be fish, all kinds of fish, to live in the water. And let there be birds, all kinds of birds, to fill the land and sky. And it happened. And God liked what he had created. Chapter 2, God made peace. First God made a man, and God called the man Adam, but Adam did not have a helper. God said, the man should not be alone, and I will make him a helper. So, God made a woman. Adam named the woman Eve, and the man and woman could think. They could talk with God. They could be friends with God. gave them food from the garden. And he told them to take care of everything. The man and woman were happy.